what's up lovely people it's a lovely day in the neighborhood and i'm your lovely camera woman ricky uh i am on my way to a i don't know what what is this what are you doing i am on my way to a gig in atlanta um it's a doula shoot um one of my friends is studying to be a well training i should say studying but you, you're studying you're training to be a doula, which is really cool. Um, one of my friends actually, um, I've seen in action. If you check out a video that I have um, on here, um, a birthing story, and she had a doula, she wanted to be, oh, hello, phone, sorry. She wanted to do a natural birth, um, and it was during the still COVID, um, lockdown era and you know sometimes it doesn't happen that way you have to be careful about a lot of things when it comes to black and brown people especially medical um, being from Alabama and you know Tuskegee experiment and all that kind of stuff especially with maternity and everything they think black women are strong and can take all the pain in the world and baby we can't okay so um, I love that I get to do this and um, you know get to meet some people who are training to do this, who do this. I would love to film, you know, people's birth. You know, just creation of life is something that's wonderful and you know precious and is a lot for women. <laughs> and the better support system you have. I think it's better for us to get through this because it does take a village um, to help grow and raise a child, okay? So um, I love that they're coming together for this photo shoot, interacting with each other and just uh, connecting, you know, because more people need to know about having to do the, you know, what you can do with your doula so I'm excited and to meet new people and network and connect you know maybe be a traveling uh birthing <laughs> person a travel a travel birth photo uh, videographer no mm, I don't know it's a beautiful thing I, I mean it's a lot <laughs> it's a lot I've seen uh at least two births I think uh, no, I seen one live. Of course, my own, you know. But uh, I didn't. I didn't have a mirror to look down there. I was like, Nah, you can keep that, okay? You can keep. I don't want to see it. I know it's gonna come out there. You know, I don't need to look at it. Um, <laughs> I just want to know it's happening. And thank you. Uh, but I have seen someone go through natural birth live, and uh, that was an experience. Uh, but now with video and photography and stuff, uh, more video for me, I would love to, you know, if somebody wanted to have a video of their home birth or their just birth in general, even if they have to go to the hospital, I think I would like to do something like that. Make it like a small documentary of a birthing story like I kind of did for my friend. So um, check out that video and also sometimes it's okay to look into all your alternatives for birth. Um, you might have a plan, but sometimes the plan doesn't work out that way. So you always need a backup plan and it happens. So on my way to Marietta, Marietta, Georgia, what's 